<laughs> oh, Mikey, let's start the Battle of the Buses. We have already built them. Let's take a look from the side. It's very interesting. I made my bus out of earth and you made it out of diamonds. Let's get to the button as soon as possible. What is she doing? Oh. Mikey, let me explain. As soon as I press the button, we will have a test that we will have to endure. So let's start the bus standoff as soon as possible. Then let's run to the button faster. Let's see what happens to us. I am very interested to find out what kind of natural phenomenon I will have to experience on the bus. Hmm. It's lightning. Now, after you press the button, I got goosebumps. Is this really going to happen to us now? Huh? Just look at how hard the lightning is hitting right now. Mikey, let's get on the bus. There's no way we can stay here. I'm sure I can survive this ordeal because I have a very good diamond bus. As soon as the lightning stops, I'll go outside right away. Uh-oh. Oh, no. Now the lightning is hitting my bus very hard and it is starting to collapse. It scares me and I need to try to fix it in every possible way. Ah! The lightning strikes incredibly hard and it seems I won't be able to survive. I don't understand why my bus from the ground is falling apart very quickly right now. The roof literally falls to the floor and I don't have time to fix it. I need to save myself urgently. I will make a separate place for myself in the corner and cover myself with earth. <gasps> I hope that I will be able to escape. I'm very scared. Interesting. How are things with my friend Mikey right now? I can see from the side that his bus is on fire and partially destroyed. We urgently need to run to him and ask how it happened. Hmm, I think I know where he can hide now. Most likely, he covered himself with earth. Mikey, come out soon. I'm not going to wait here long. Your bus couldn't stand the lightning test, so let's go to the button now. I agree. I hope that this time my bus will be able to withstand such terrible trials. I never thought that lightning would destroy my bus so much. It's all on fire and the roof is completely destroyed. I'll have to rebuild it all, so let's find out what awaits us next as soon as possible. I am sure that I will definitely be able to withstand the next test. Don't wait too long and press the button. <laughs> Tornado! Now we will need to pass this particular test. I don't think I'll have any problems. <gasps> I'm hearing a very strong wind sound right now and a tornado is coming here. Mikey, we need to run and hide urgently. I'm scared? I still can't believe we're going to be in the middle of a tornado right now. I'm running by my bus now and I'll be waiting there. I have no other choice and I have to wait out the tornado here. I'm sure it won't destroy my bus. It's impossible because I made it out of diamonds. We can only wait and watch from the side as Mikey's bus collapses. He could be very seriously hurt. tornado is bringing great destruction to my bus. It's much worse than lightning because I can't keep up completely with how much earth is raining down on me from above. This is a real horror and a curse. I have never seen such a natural phenomenon, but it destroys everything in its path. Rocks and trees are flying at me. It seems there is no way to save the bus, but I will try to do it. I'm starting to panic because this could all end very badly for me. <laughs> I'm not going to recover all this anymore because stones are constantly flying at my head. I'll hide the same way I did that time. I hope I can survive. Yeah. The tornado is over. And now I'm going to see how Mikey coped with this challenge. I am very interested to find out. I see that his bus is almost completely destroyed and destroyed. It's all on fire and there's earth scattered everywhere. Mikey, how come you didn't pass this test? I still can't believe it. I do not know how you are going to pass the next test. I talk to you too much. Therefore, I suggest that you go to the button as soon as possible. I think that next time everything will be fine and my bus will perform perfectly. Press the button. <laughs> if you are sure, then I will do it. Let's see what kind of test awaits us. It became very interesting to me. I'm pressing the button. Sure that we will really be able to withstand it. I have a very 
very strange feeling right now and it seems like she's coming here. Let's get on the bus now. It's so huge. I never would have thought that she would catch up with us so quickly. Now, we need to hope only for the best. Ugh. If there is at least one crack in my bus, then the lava will definitely seep through it. I hope this doesn't happen. I can only hope and wait. I hid in my bus. Oh, I don't understand how I can survive right now because the wave is coming. I can see how the lava is already slowly starting to flow into my bus. It seems that I am in a very bad situation right now and it will be extremely difficult to get out of it. I will try to restore it now with the help of the earth. The main thing is to close the roof so that the lava seeps further. But I see that there is more and more of it and I start to panic. I do not know what to do next. I'm at a loss. I never would have thought that I would face so many problems. But I have no other choice now. I can only hope that I can still survive. It's very hot. The lava burns me all the time and my head starts to spin. Outside, now the lava has completely enveloped my bus and I do not know what to do with it. I just might not get off my bus. Now I'm caught in a fire and I'm in a lot of pain. The lava is over and now I'm going outside. I see that Mikey's bus is now completely covered with her. Huh? Therefore, I start throwing water and hope that everything will definitely get better. It's a terrible situation. I didn't expect Mikey to be in it. It is still very surprising that Mikey was very poorly prepared. Because of this, his bus could not withstand any test. Now I am very good at extinguishing lava with water and it turns into stone. Oh! We need to find Mikey urgently. He's somewhere nearby. I can feel it. I'll try to get inside. I'm here. Please save me. You have no idea how scared I am and I don't know what to do. Unfortunately, I got into a very bad situation and the lava completely engulfed me. We need to try to get out now in all possible ways and somehow fix this whole situation. <laughs> My bus is completely destroyed and I do not know what to do now. Let's look at him from the outside now. Very bad. Mikey, I have no other comments because your bus showed a very bad side. Just look at him. Oh. It is now completely destroyed and I do not know how you will pass the next test. I am sure that it will be very dangerous, so we need to prepare. It's extremely hard to watch your buse completely drown in lav. Hmm. Soon we will be attacked by monsters and this is our next test, but we need to prepare as best we can for this. Let's take all the materials we can find from the chest now. We must reinforce our buses now and prepare for the attack. I think we will definitely be able to do it. Soon we will check who really protected their bus better. I am very glad that I have now come across very good materials. Therefore, I will protect my bus with spikes. I think it will definitely work out. We need to surround him with all possible traps so that the monsters do not come to us. The main thing is that Mikey doesn't distract me and I still did the job as planned. Now I'm already starting to put spikes all around the bus. I need to hurry up because there is very little time left. As soon as night falls, the monsters here will immediately appear here. I am sure that we will have a huge number of difficult battles at once. <laughs> I'm looking at Mikey's bus right now and I'm amazed. He's not even going to rebuild it. If the monsters come here, he will never be able to escape again. These are his problems and I'm not going to be distracted by them. I have an idea. Unbelievable. I've heard what you're saying about me and I really don't like it. So try not to speak out in my direction anymore. It offends me very much and I don't want you to make any decisions for me. I'm going to be fine. I will definitely strengthen my bus with all possible traps. No monster will be able to get inside. I guarantee you that. I will destroy everyone in my path. Mikey is starting to tell me something now, but I'm definitely not going to listen to him. The most important thing for me now is to make a moat around my bus. I will definitely pour lava there so that no monster can get to me. I see from the outside that Mikey is busy with some kind of business right now, and that's good. Yeah. For now, I just keep digging with a shovel. I hope this will give me some kind of result. I never would have thought that I would have to face so much work. We have to do a lot in a very short period of time and protect our buses. I don't want this night to come because there will be a huge number of monsters. But I'm not scared by any means and I think everything will go well. Now I've already finished digging and poured lava into it. <laughs>
The fencing of my bus does not end there. Now is the time to surround the entire territory with barbed wire. This will definitely stop the monsters and they won't be able to get inside. I think this is the coolest idea and you definitely shouldn't give it up. I have a lot of problems right now that I have to solve. Therefore, you need to try to finish the job as soon as possible. I'm very interested in what Mikey has done now. Do you hear me? <laughs> yes, I see that you have prepared very well now. But I doubt the barbed wire will help you when the monsters come here. The most important thing for us is that the buses are intact. If everything goes as I said, then we will withstand the attack of the monsters and no one will be able to defeat me. I'm just having fun and working a little bit for now. I'm definitely not going to rush because I don't have the strength. Mikey sometimes amazes me with his thoughts and it's pointless to listen to him at all. Now I'm going to make a sand moat and it's very cool because every monster will drown in it and it will be extremely difficult for him to get out. Therefore, I'm definitely not going to stop. It's going to be night soon and we should hurry up. I feel like we're going to have a lot of problems, but now I'm done with my work. <laughs> then let's wait for nightfall now. I am sure that I can defeat the terrible monsters that will come here. Now we just have to wait. <laughs> oh no, I can see now that they appeared here. The night has come and we must not allow them to approach us in any case, because then an explosion will occur. We are urgently running to our buses now and starting battles with them. I urgently need to destroy them with a blaster right now. Therefore, in no case can I allow our defeat. I'm very good at hitting them, but there are really a lot of monsters. I don't understand how Mikey can handle them. I see that you are standing at the very top right now. Please help me. I need you to shoot too. Come down and start destroying them. I'm very scared. I really liked it, but I'll take your advice. I hope that we will be able to do it after all. The main thing is not to allow them to approach our bus in any case. You understand that at any moment they can explode and then we will not be able to restore them. There are more and more monsters every minute, but you are very cool to destroy them with a blaster. Woohoo! The blaster helps me very well because with it, I have no problem destroying every monster that even comes close to my bus. I see Mikey running around them now and they're constantly exploding. This is also a very good tactic, but much more dangerous. I think there's no point in me staying upstairs, so I have to go down too. We need to destroy everyone who is here with a blaster. Hmm. Help me urgently, because now they are starting to surround me. I'm just afraid that I won't get out of this terrible situation. There are even more monsters, and as soon as I approach them, they start exploding. I think we need to hurry up and solve this problem as soon as possible, because a lot depends on it. If we don't protect our buses now, then the monsters will win. <laughs> Mikey, the main thing now is not to panic ahead of time. I know what to do, and I will destroy everyone who is here. All that remains is to run around our buses and shoot a blaster. We need to survive until morning now because these monsters only live at night. There are more and more of them and it's starting to upset me, but I think I will definitely succeed. Uh oh. The main thing is to believe in it and continue on. I'm very tired. They're starting to surround me and it's very bad. I have to reload every time because the blaster is running out of ammo. I think that in the near future, everything will definitely end well for me. But in no case will I put down my weapon and surrender to these monsters. Oh. They won't get on our buses and destroy them. This is already a principled battle in which I must win. Mikey has run away somewhere now and I don't understand where he is right now. Therefore, I will continue the battle with them myself. I hope I can see him soon because I need backup. It is very difficult for one to shoot at it because there are even more monsters and they start attacking in large groups. I wonder how much longer we have to live this night. Monsters will still appear here. If anything, I'm here and I'm also trying to destroy them with a machine gun, but I just don't do it so effectively. Your blaster has now dealt very coolly with a large army of monsters that came here. I have a very cool idea for you. I hope you'll listen to her. It's very important to know. Maybe we'll take a short break now and wait for even more of them to gather to blow up. It's going to be fun. 
Mikey, we're not going to be able to do this because I'm short of bullets right now. I have no choice but to continue the battle with these terrible creatures. They are getting closer to our buses, but it seems their armies are starting to lose, and I'm really happy about it. It will be morning soon, and then we will defeat them. The main thing is to wait for this moment and not relax. Uh-oh. Okay, then I'll trust you now. I hope you understand the danger we are in. I see that you are very good at fighting them, so I definitely won't bother you. Soon we will get through this night and finally be able to live in peace. I hope that we will be able to do it. I don't want our buses to be damaged and the world to be shrouded in darkness. I believe in our victory. <sighs> Mikey, it's morning now and all the monsters are gone. We have passed all the tests that were here. I am incredibly happy about this. Now no one will be able to attack us. We can safely rejoice and have fun. I suggest we get to it as soon as possible. That's how our incredible story ended. Thank you all so much for watching. <laughs> Subscribe to the channel, like it, and leave your comments.